Carol Middleton undergoes Hollywood transformation in rarely pictured second mother of the bride dress. The Princess of Wales made a much-anticipated outfit change on her wedding day with Prince William, swapping her lace Alexander McQueen wedding dress for a belted evening gown. But she wasn't the only one to switch up her look. After the royal couple's ceremony at Westminster Abbey and lunch reception hosted by the late Queen Elizabeth at Buckingham Palace, the bride and groom as well as their guests retired to their own quarters to freshen up for the evening party. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. As Kate and William prepare to mark their 13th wedding anniversary, we can't help but wonder what Kate's inner circle, the Middleton family, wore to the private evening, attended by 300 guests. While very few post-wedding photos exist, one rare snap captured Carol in her uber-glamorous second mother of the bride outfit. She had swapped her demio pastel blue dress and matching coat from Catherine Walker for a Hollywood-worthy black floor-length gown. Features included a low v-neck, pleated flutter sleeves, a belted waist and a tiered skirt, and Carol recycled the gown for the British Red Cross International Fundraising Committee Ambassadors Gala in London in 2013. For the royal wedding appearance, she amped up the drama with a sparkling necklace and drop earrings. In order to fully display the latter, the party pieces founder had swept her shoulder-length hair into an intricate updo finished with sparkly hair accessories, while her fringe remained down to frame her face. Carol stood next to her other daughter, Pippa, who had acted as maid of honor for Kate. After causing a stir in her figure-skimming white cowl-neck bridesmaid dress, Pippa slipped into a much bolder hue to celebrate her sister and new brother-in-law's nuptials. She rocked an emerald green dress with a plunging neckline and thick straps, finished with Grecian embellishments under the bust and on the shoulders. Unlike her mother, who had switched up her beauty look, Pippa kept her hair in the half-updo with cascading curls she had been wearing for the ceremony. Carol later admitted that she wasn't overly stressed about the royal wedding, despite the fact that it was such a high-profile occasion streamed on TV across the world. After confessing she hates shopping, she told The Telegraph in an interview, like every mother, I wanted to look my best, make my children proud and enjoy the day. I honestly don't think I was any more stressed than any other mother of the bride. In the same chat, Carol shared some behind-the-scenes details about the planning that went into the nuptials. We talked about music. Everything. I was involved lots with both Pip's and Catherine's weddings, the mother of three said. Carol added that she had learnt some key lessons in the preparation process, including don't muscle in on the guest list. She continued, but I think the most important thing, as a parent, is to listen to what your daughter wants. You can have all the ideas in the world, but it has to be about them. And don't muscle in on the guest list. By comparison, Carol enjoyed a much more low-key wedding with her husband Michael in June 1980. Kate's parents exchanged vows in Buckinghamshire before enjoying a simple bonfire and chili con carne in the evening. Carol wore a boho bridal gown with a bardo neckline, and embroidered ruffle detailing which were revealed in her son James Middleton's wedding photos after she lent the frock to her daughter-in-law Alizy Thevenet. Carol and Michael Middleton have always been exceptionally supportive of their daughter Princess Kate, and son-in-law Prince William. Reports over Easter revealed that Carol headed to Windsor to be with her the princess whilst she is undergoing cancer treatment, which, as a hands-on grandmother to George, 10, Charlotte, 8 and Louis, 5, doesn't come as much of a surprise. While she was there, Carol was also spotted on a low-key outing with her son-in-law, Prince William. Michael too has an exceptional bond with his grandchildren, who can forget when Princess Charlotte was pictured pulling a funny face at her grandfather at the sailing regatta in 2019.